Hey, what is up, Wolfpack? It's me, Cal here, and today I'm showing you guys how to get the Gracie Auto Shotgun Gold in Call of Duty Vanguard multiplayer quick and easy. So first things first is, of course, you're probably going to want to level up your weapon a lot faster if you guys don't know how to do that. In the pinned card up above right now, you guys can check out a video I made on that subject. But without further ado, let's just hop right into this. So first things first, you have to get 300 eliminations, 50 headshots, and 50 multi-kills. Now, let me get this straight with you guys right away. Do not play core. This gun is absolute trash in core. Do not play core. Might as well, you might as well use a knife. Uh, you, actually, you might be better off using a knife in core. But um, the Gracie Auto, yeah, go play hardcore. Uh, it's going to be better for you. And that's how you're going to get these multi-kills, these headshots, and these eliminations done. And it's going to be a lot better time, trust me. And next up, you're going to get 5 kills without dying 30 times. Once again, stay in hardcore. Personally, I like to play hardcore blitz, something like domination. But uh, hardcore blitz where there's a lot of people and a lot of chance to kind of be sneaky, flank around. Maybe stay off the radar if you need to. Otherwise, try to keep everything close quarters relatively, like pretty close, as close as you can. Because Gracie is little to no range at all. Try to keep it inside of buildings and in corridors and stuff like that anything that'll help you out but for the most part i was just focusing on getting the five kills without dying and trying to do that I'd, i basically get one or two maybe even three if i was lucky every game so i just focused on that and slowly did the rest of the challenges whilst focusing on that now first things first is let me show you guys a class setup you're going to want to aim for. This is kind of an early on class setup. There might be an attachment or two that you unlock a little bit later into the gun, but this is kind of your ideal early on class setup that I highly recommend for using this gun, and hopefully that helps you out. But nonetheless, the next challenge you have to get is get 50 long range kills. Now this is of course shotgun long range, which is not very long at all. I'll show you guys a clip here. This is about as far away you need to be to actually hit long shots with the Gracie Auto. And the best way I can put it is if you're far away from an enemy or, you know, medium range, I'd say anything that you might think is long range for a shotgun, just go ahead and shoot your shotgun at them. And if it hits them, then continue firing and you'll get that long shot kill. After that, you have to get 100 close range kills. This, of course, is just, you know, point blank up close, pretty much. It's not even point blank. It's pretty much anything that isn't long range. So be relatively close. You're going to get these done without even trying, to be honest. I was still focusing on my getting my five kills without dying 30 times when I actually completed this and I don't know if it's just me but this gun is kind of busted for me meaning I did up to here on the challenges and I unlocked gold for the gun so I'll just leave that out there for anyone that might uh, be interested and uh, <laughs> and next up you have to get 101 shot kills once again very easy and hardcore just get relatively close and you can one shot people especially if you get a headshot it's gonna be a one shot kill even at longer ranges next up you're gonna have to get 100 hip fire kills with the CGC 22 inch rapid barrel the 12 gauge 7 round mags and the chariot sports stock this of course is just hip fire kills so pretty easy but that does mean you have to be a bit closer to the enemies than typical and just Make sure you have some good sprint to fire speed and i believe gung ho is on this weapon it, it is and i do recommend using that that's gonna help out with your hip fires a lot as well next up you're gonna have to get 50 headshots again but this time with the extra range mags the chariot s huntsman stock and the tight grip proficiency of course when you're doing any of these you can have other attachments on as long as it doesn't replace any of these three that are required for the challenge for the most part i use the shotgun hip firing and if people are at range that's when i aim and just aim for the head if you're to be aiming but if you're close up and you can hip fire just hip fire relatively high up on the chest or towards the head and you should get that hit headshot in and this should go pretty easily as well and your final challenge for this gun is to get 100 aiming down sight kills with the sawed off barrel the cgc h4 stock and the frenzy proficiency so make sure you have good aim down sight time and just walk around aiming if you have to or just run and aim at people and get those kills in and it's only 100 so it's not too bad but lucky for me i haven't had to do these last three attachment challenges because like i said for some reason gold unlocked once i did kind of like five sets of challenges give or take so maybe that's the same case for you let me know in the comments down below but once you've done all that nonetheless you should get gold for the gracie auto shotgun now i think gold looks okay on this shotgun it doesn't cover too much of it at all actually but i do like the black pattern and i guess that's kind of nice to look at i suppose but it could be better Overall, what do I think of the Gracie Auto Shotgun? I think you guys can tell by what I've told you already, but um, I don't know what it was like before it was nerfed, because I only just got to this gun after shotguns were nerfed, and it is trash. D don't use it. There's any, any shotgun, please. Any other shotgun you can use. D don't use this one. Anyways, guys, let me know what you guys think of the Gracie in the comments down below and the camo challenges. If you guys enjoyed or found this useful, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.